Hello wonderful Finance Oracle family, I trust you are doing well today. Well I'm here again this beautiful day to discuss with you and give you information that will help you to achieve your migration dream. So guys, if you are looking for a country to move this train train for, you are thinking of a place to migrate, then this video is for you. Today I'm going to be telling you about a country called Malta. Yeah, Malta is a country that um, is in this heart of Europe and well-developed country with um, high standard of living and quality education. So if you're looking for a country where you migrate, where your children will get first class education, first class health facilities and Medicare, then Malta is the country you should be thinking about. Malta is a wonderful country. Education in Malta is cheap and not just that education in Malta is cheap. If you study Malta and graduate and work in Malta for at least one year, they will refund you 70% of your total cost of study so you can imagine that means they want to retain people and keep you to work in Malta there are a lot of beautiful things I can tell you about Malta and I'm going to tell you different routes you can move to Malta number one route to move to Malta is through the Skyscape program Malta is experiencing huge shortage of level so if you want to move to Malta I will show you a way I mean website where you can apply for jobs and move to Malta. And if you move to Malta and live in Malta for five years, you will be qualified to apply for permanent residency. Okay? While in Malta, you're going to get good healthcare facility, good education facility for your children, and all at free cost. Okay? And there are a lot of um, jobs all around in different sectors in Malta, which I'm going to explore with you today so that you can see how you can apply for this job okay now the beautiful thing about getting a job in Malta if you find a job in Malta you can move to Malta in 15 working days your visa will be ready okay so um, currently the threshold is 25,000 euro if you have been paid 25,000 euro in a year it means you would be able to apply to move to Malta usually it Previously, it was 32,500 euro, but at a point, the um, employers in Malta spoke to them, reached out to the government and let them know that it's difficult for them to find people to work for them, and they reduced the threshold to 25,000 euro to enable more people qualify for this process. So, this is what it takes to move to Malta through employment. The next route is through education. If you get an admission and study in Malta or find an admission in Malta, you can move with your family, you can move with your spouse, and if you have children, you can move with your children, and you can settle down in Malta. And like I said earlier on, if you study in Malta and graduate, and start working in Malta and work for one year, they will refund you 70% of your total cost of education. So you see how much they are willing and interested to keep people to stay back in Malta. Another way to move to Malta is through the um, Digital Nomad Visa. The Digital Nomad Visa allows you to um, live in Malta even when you don't work in Malta. But then um, previously, I think it was, um, I forgot how much it was previously, but currently now you need to earn about 14,000 euro for you to move to Malta. Well, the reason is that the government is trying to reduce the number of people that come through the Digital Nomad Visa and they want people to come through work visa and other um, immigration channels, okay? The last option is what is known as a Maltese family reunion. For you to go with this um, route, you need to marry a Maltese citizen. And this is the only way you can go through this um, channel. So guys, this is four routes which you can use to come to Malta. And I'm going to take you through um, some websites where I will show you how to find a job in Malta and the things you need to do. But guys, if you're seeing my video for the first time, my name is Martin, and uh, my channel is 
Finance Oracle. I make video that will help you to achieve your migration dream without you spending money on immigration lawyer or agents or even um, becoming a victim of circumstances where they might take your money and will not give you the services you need. So guys, stay tuned in this video as I take you through the website. But in the meantime, do not forget to like this video, do not forget to share it and subscribe if you have not subscribed to my channel. So now let's go through the website. Yeah guys, so the first website I'm going to take you through is Jobs in Malta. Yeah, if you come to this website, all you need to do is to click the category of job you want and search. Actually, there are thousands of jobs in this website, so you can go through all the jobs. So it is better you filter it. For example, let's say you're a nurse, you can just um, filter it and type nurse or, you know, or registered nurse, wherever you wish to type. Then you can find the list of jobs you can. Let's search for engineer and see the number of jobs we get in this search. Yeah, if you search for engineers, you're going to get a lot of jobs. You can see software engineer, process engineer, piping engineer, mechanical engineer, develop engineer, data engineer, infrastructure engineer. And you can see the salary ranges. So for you to move to Malta, you just need a salary range of up to 25 euro a year, 25,000 euro a year, but you can see most of these salaries are up to 45,000, 50,000 euro, 35,000 euro. So that means that all this just qualifies you to move to Malta through the highly skilled job. Okay, I can search this and um, and apply for these jobs. Okay, so there are other websites which I would like to take you through. So I won't be spending much time. So if you yeah, so the next thing I want to talk about is MK Malta Recruitment Agency. This is actually a leading agency in Malta that um, employs people to come to Malta. They have reputation, you can see. They have application accepted. They've accepted up to 2,200, and they have up to 2,000 vacancies. So this is a lot of vacancies, and you can see them on LinkedIn, on Facebook, on Instagram. Well, they are genuine with um, research about them. So if you are looking for a job, you can actually hit here, okay? Uh, but if you are looking for an employee, then you hit here. So if you're also looking for a job, you can hit here and you can get the ball rolling, okay? You can also click the apply now button to just fill out the application and submit your CV, okay? Yeah, so look at what they've said here. We can help you identify and find the right job according to your ability and experience. So you can click here and see the information they have for you yeah so these are the different industries these are vacancies in retail vacancies in construction vacancies in hospitality vacancies in industrial manufacturing vacancies in um, transportation vacancy and all that so you can actually keep, click on transportation vacancy and you see what they have they have driver heavy vehicle drivers and you can see what they are looking at for drivers and you can hit up the apply now button to apply okay there are numer numerous jobs for drivers and there are numerous jobs for heavy vehicle drivers like the trucks like the um, construction equipment um, construction trucks the tankers and all that you know cargo trucks they are all under this category okay so if you have to go back and you want to look out for some other industries let's say the hospitality industry you can click here and you see they have housekeeper, receptionist, chef, they've got housekeeping, uh, food and beverage, server, chef, barista, maintenance, food and beverage supervisor. So let's say you want to um, click for housekeeping, you can also come here and apply for housekeeping, okay? I see what they need for a housekeeper, the job description, the requirement, and the important fundamentals, the things you need to know. Then if you are applying for as a supervisor, this is the job description requirement and the things you need to know. Okay, general maintenance as well, receptionist and all other housekeeping jobs or hospitality jobs rather. So guys, this is it about MK. MK is actually has um, a lot of jobs in their portfolio for you. So if you just come here, you can actually apply now and select which industry where you want to work and drop your CV and get the application rolling okay yeah so that is it i'd like to go to the next guys and this is motor international recruitment agency 
They're one of the most reputable agents in Malta and not just in Malta, even across Europe. So if you want to work in Malta, you can actually come here and say, find a job. I can see the jobs which they are recruiting. They mostly recruit for chef, um, cleaners, you know, doctors, hosts, kitchen, maids, you know, a lot of other nurses and security guards and even engineers have been recruited in this um, by this agency. So you can actually hit up this place and apply. Then they have offices in Tunisia, in India, in Bangladesh, in United Kingdom. But then you can just come online and apply. If you want to contact them for more detailed information, you can actually hit up here. But then let's say you want to apply as a doctor, then you can hit up this place and see what information they have for you. So you can come up here and see what they want from you as a doctor and the criteria to work in more as a doctor. We are the Motor International Recruitment Agency Limited advocates for best working condition and practices. We abide by the hospitality, hospitals and clinic, wages council, wage regulation, blah, blah, blah. So you can just read down that. I don't want to waste my time on this. Oh uh, yeah. So let's say the minimum expected condition includes 40 hours a week with possible overtime. Overtime pay at um, 1 is to 1.5 and one is to point two, one is to two for Sunday and holidays, okay? Yeah, so let's see. Yeah, other information you need, you can get them here. There are other benefits like meals and all the rest of them, you can look at up them here. And uh, look at the things they need from you for the candidates. All candidates must provide all documents required and must have a good command of English and a Maltese or an or Maltese ALTS certificate are preferred. Should you require any other information, please do not hesitate to contact us. Kindly note that traditional clothing is not allowed while on duty. If interested, please fill the attached form below. All fields must be completed, okay? So this is it, and you can hit up this and apply to work in Malta as a doctor, okay? Yeah, so this is it. So let's um, move on to this website, dear.gov.mt. This is where you're going to see all the agents which are recognized in Malta that you can actually apply for a job with. So you can come to this website and look for the employment, employ, employment agencies which are approved by the government of Malta to um, get people to come to Malta to work, okay? And this is a list of employment agencies. So there are many of them, and these are all the ones that are certified by the government. So if anyone is not in this list, then you have to be careful so that you don't get to the wrong hands, okay? Yeah, this is a PDF file, and as much as possible, I'm going to drop this link in the comments in the description section of this video, and you can assess it at your own time and go through it. Yeah. Okay. It's a bit slow. Let's just wait a little. Yeah. This is it. There are so many of them. Let's see if we can zoom them. Yeah. So you can see. I've zoomed them. These are the employment agent and the address, their phone numbers, their emails. So this is a great resource for you. I mean, if you start writing all these agents, I, I, I can't really imagine you write 50% of this agent and you will not find a job. It is not possible. So guys, this is very important thing. If you are interested, you may have to save it and start writing them one after the other, okay? Yep, so that is it. So let's move on to the next process, which is the digital nomad visa. So if you want to come to Malta to work, you can come through this process. Initially, it used to be 32,400 euro, but now they've made it your salary has to be up to 42,000 euro for you to qualify to work as a digital nomad, sorry, to move to um, Malta as a digital nomad. This is because they actually want to reduce the digital nomad that comes to Malta and they want more people who could actually contribute um, immensely to the economy of Malta by working and living in Malta, not just living and working elsewhere, okay? So your tax comes to Malta if you work and live in Malta. Yeah, so then you can apply from this place. Then the next I want to talk about, I've talked about tech.co, so the next I want to talk about is 
working in malta.com these are actually the government um, websites where you can get information on how you can work in malta every information which you need including how to apply for the e-resident permit work permit you know open a bank account the health and you know other information about health care social security issues insurance tax and all that so you can actually is a very helpful website and i've opened a link where you can also click here on the jobs to see the jobs in Malta. you can actually hit up here and it's gonna take you to this link where you can see um, job details in Malta. so if you want to work as a marketing manager you can hit up here to see this job assistant fmp manager operations manager maintenance manager you know financial accountant back-end developer assistant financial and a whole lot of them you can go up to 43 pages and see counting for this job so guys you can hit up and apply for this job well if you want to prepare a cv this is a great place to prepare your cv um the europass um website you can create your europass cv here it's going to give you every information you need to create an europass cv that will help you to achieve your immigration dream to malta or to anywhere in europe or even across the world so guys this is very important for you to log in up to this website and get the ball rolling okay so this is the information i have for you today it's a beautiful day and i'm sure if you put up these things which you you've heard today in this video in practice i'm sure you're gonna get a job in malta malta is currently looking for a lot of people to come and work in malta and like i said there are beautiful things about malta not just that it's a beautiful place but it has well stable economy and it has got a lot of healthcare facilities i mean quality care facilities and quality education for your children where they can study free of course so guys if you ask me malta is one of the places you should consider so guys if you like this video i want you to give it a big thumb and i would wish to see you in my next video best of luck have a great day